guys welcome back to my channel today's video we are doing part two of my lipstick declutter lip glosses and liquid lipstick declutter series we've got one two three four five six to go through we went through seven uh in the first video so i went and had a soda and relaxed a little bit so that i could get some energy to do this we got rid of quite a bit of lip products before but i really need to pare down the rest of all of this so we're gonna go ahead and just hop right in okay so these are kylie liquid lipsticks i didn't like the glosses she put out i didn't like the brush on them I, the glosses were fine. I just didn't like the brushes, so I gave all those away in the last declutter. These are all the liquid lipsticks. I love some of these colors, but honestly, I hate the formula. Hate them. So I'm going to go ahead and pass those along because ColourPop makes the same product, and it's less expensive, and they have a better formula. So, gotta go. I'm being cutthroat. I'm just so done with having so much crap that I don't even use. So I'm I'm gonna fly through this hopefully. This one's gotta go, sorry. Okay, so this is a gloss from LA Colors and there is two more here. The red one I'm gonna keep, I know I'm gonna keep the nude, but this one I'm never gonna wear. So I'm gonna go ahead and pass that along. There's this L'Oreal Infallible Create, I Create. I'm not 100% sure if this is a liquid lipstick. It's a really pretty color though. Is that gloss? Why don't they label these darn things? This one's newer too. I'm just gonna put this in with the glosses. I'm gonna keep it. I like that color. This is a liquid matte lipstick from LA Colors. I've got one, two of them. And honestly, I don't particularly like their formula so i'm gonna go ahead and pass those guys on bare minerals this one is wink it's a matte formula unfortunately it's too light i think yeah i'm gonna pass that along this one what is this a liquid cat suit nudist peach is this a matte lipstick okay let's take a look here it's a pretty color but Honestly, I've got other ones like it. So I'm gonna go ahead and pass that guy on. This one is Profusion Metal Matte Lip Cream. I will never wear this. I'm very picky. Um, so I'm gonna pass that guy on. And this one is a Bare Minerals Matte. I'm assuming this is a matte. What color is this in? Scandal? That's really dark in person. It doesn't come up that dark on camera, but it is much darker in person. So we're gonna go ahead and pass him along. These are all, what are these? These are the blotted lips that didn't last very long with, I don't even think they make these anymore. From ColourPop, I like these, so I'm gonna go ahead and keep them. I don't even know where I'm gonna put them. You know what, I'm gonna put them with my lip crowns. All of these stains from Milk and from Elf, I'm keeping, I love these lip stains. They're so good, you guys. And they're so good to put on before you put on liquid lipstick so that you don't get that ring around the inner rim of your mouth they're just they're really good so i'm keeping those i'm going to put them in with the glosses and then these ones are from black moon cosmetics we're definitely not keeping all of these um oh there's another bare minerals here in infamous yeah i like that color i'm going to keep infamous from bare minerals this one is harvest i love this color i love the formula of black moon cosmetics i love this color it's so good. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep this one. This one is Libra. I already know I'm keeping this guy. Amazing. What is this? This one is Warmth from Black Moon. Oh, that's really dark in person. I'm gonna go ahead and pass that guy on. This one is Grim. Yeah, super brown in person. Gotta go to someone else. This one is Deranged. Oh yeah, it's like dark, dark, dark red in person. It's coming off a little bit more bright in, uh, on camera, but I really like that color. I'm gonna keep that. This one is Celine. Been in here forever. Yeah, definitely not my, my color. I'm gonna pass that on. And then this one, it doesn't even have a name on it because the sticker fell off. So fortunately we've got a no name, but I love that color. So we're keeping that. So I'm trying to keep a good range of colors. It's just the formulas on some of these that drive me nuts. Some of them are just overly drying. Some of them are just not as opaque as I'd like. Some are too opaque. 
depending on what we're talking about, if it comes to like glosses or liquid lipsticks or whatever. So I'm kind of picky. Like I feel like I'm super picky. And with all of this crap, I should be, I guess. Oh, okay. So this is a vivid lip paint in Flamingo from Give Me Glow Cosmetics. Oh my God. They have some of the best products I've just I've been loving their stuff lately and I have a bunch of their the palettes that are custom made that are huge and I was featured on their Instagram forever ago and honestly like their stuff is just so good that color is freaking beautiful I'm keeping that and I love their packaging it's so cute liquid lipstick from give me glow this is called wildlife they used to do mystery boxes every month I don't think they do that anymore I love that color. Keeping that. And the formulation is perfect. And then this one from Give Me Glow is Flamboyance. I can read. Oh my God. Yes. Keeping. Totally keeping. So those ones. This one is from Wet n Wild. This is Coral Corruption. And this is a matte liquid lipstick. Let's see about this color. Yeah, see, it's not as opaque. Gotta go. Sorry, buddy. Give Me Glow has so much. I just love their products. Black Moon, like indie brands that are freaking awesome. Black Moon and Give Me Glow. Man, those two killing it. This is an Insta Mat from Smashbox. Keeping it. I'm gonna put it in here. This is from Jouer. I don't even know. There's not a name or anything on it. I'm just gonna pass it along. This is Burt's Bees liquid lipstick, and this is in the color taupe. That one's pretty. Yeah, that one's good. Keeping Burt's Bees. This is Bare Minerals Slay, and their formula is okay. I like that color though. It's kind of purpley. Yeah, we're keeping that. Go with the other Bare Minerals. And then this is Profusion. This is a matte, uh, matte dream is what it's called. I haven't tried this one yet. I just got it, um, but I like that color. So I think I'm gonna keep that. Liquid lipsticks are in these two so far that we're keeping. And yeah, so, and then these are the bullet and crayons. So, so far so good. We have gotten rid of quite a few and we haven't even hit the ones in the back yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and just keep rolling. We're doing good. And we're actually got a decent amount of color in here. It's not all nudes, which I know that was some people's complaints on some of the other declutter videos I was watching to get myself ramped up for this particular declutter. So these are ColourPop Ultra Matte Lips. Again, not my favorite formula. So I think what I'm gonna do is just pass these guys along. I just, I never wear them because they're really drying. So I found other ones I like better. Those all gotta go, unfortunately. And these are matte lips from LA Girl. Let's go ahead and go through these because sadly I have too many of them and a lot of these colors are not going to be saved. I can tell you that right now. So we're just gonna dump them out. This one is Hot Stuff. And it's so funny because you can pop it off like this. So you can pop them off, which I think is a cool concept so that they look like that. So this color, I think it's one of the hotter pink ones. I'm gonna keep that. This one is Frisky. I don't think I'll ever wear that, so I'm gonna go ahead and pass that guy on. This one is Arm Candy. Never gonna wear that. This one is Manic. Never gonna wear it. This one is Sweet Revenge. And honestly, not bad. It's actually really pretty but I seriously don't think I'll wear it. All right, so that one's gotta go. This one is Relentless. Yeah, I'll keep that one, that one's pretty. This is Vavoom. 
and it is purple. Never gonna wear that. This one is Snuggle. Yeah, I'm all about Snuggle. That one's gorgeous, keeping that. This one, what is this one? This is Hush, keeping that. This one is Spicy, and yeah, not keeping that. I can go to a better home. This one is Gossip, Gossip. Woo, girl, pink. You know what, I don't have anything that I kept that's like hot, hot pink, I don't think. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep that guy because I really do like the formulation on these. This one is Bite Me and it is red. Yeah, I like that. I'm gonna keep that guy. And this one is Bliss, looks like that. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna pass that guy on. This one. This one is electric, bright AF, I'm not gonna keep that. And then this one, this one's pretty, this one's blessed. Yeah, I'm gonna keep that guy, something different. Okay, so not too, too many. We got rid of a decent amount. So we only kept those, so I'm gonna go ahead, my battery's about to die. So I'm gonna go ahead and charge the battery really quick and I'll be right back, but we only kept these for the LA girl. Okay, we are back now that my camera has decided to work and my battery is somewhat full. So let's go ahead and everything's going everywhere. What is this? Is this an ultra satin lip? Okay, so this is a satin lip too. Where is the other ones? Okay, this is a satin lip. This is a satin lip. This purple one, let's go ahead and take a look at this purple one because I'm keeping this guy. What do you guys think? Yeah, that's gorgeous. I'm going to keep that and I don't have one like that yet. Alrighty, so these are the lip lingeries. I've had these for ages and I never reach for these ever and I feel like there's better formulas out there. So all of these are going to go. Like, ridiculous, I know, but they're all... They gotta go, unfortunately. Oh, this is what happens when you buy too much. <laughs> so, okay, I've got the Melt, what is this? This is a liquid longwear lipstick. I think I've got a few more of these somewhere. I'm not a crazy about these. So I'm gonna go ahead and pass that along. This is a High Shine lipstick. So I think Wet n Wild is trying to do like a it's an opaque gloss, and that's kind of pretty. So I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna go through these little guys from ColourPop. These are Ultra Satin Lips. Yeah, all of these. When did I buy these? Like, legitimately. Ultra Satin Lips. Ah, this is a buxom, I'll put that back. Okay, so let's go ahead and swatch these bad boys. This one is London Fog. I like that color. I'm gonna keep that guy, he's little. This one is in Strip. Yeah, that one's beautiful. This one is Dopey, so I'm gonna go ahead and just, I do really like that color. It's a little bit darker in person that it shows up on camera, and it looks a little bit more purple, but I love it. I'm gonna go ahead and keep that. Um, Frickin' Frack. Let's go ahead and take a look here. That one looks very much like Dopey, but less purple. I'm gonna go ahead and keep that too. I like that. And these are little guys too, so this is kind of awesome. Okay, so those are going to stay. Oh, it's the TARDIS lip paint. I'm gonna keep all these little guys together so I know to use them. It's pretty awesome, yeah. See, I'm gonna go ahead and keep him with the ColourPop ones because they're little minis. And I love minis because I feel like I don't have to work on trying to pan them so quickly because you don't get a whole lot of product and you get to test the color and the formulation without overly committing. I don't understand people that give away or don't use their miniatures. I use them all the time and they're wonderful. Sorry about that if it was like, I'm trying to grab another wet wipe here. 
but I absolutely love miniatures. I just don't understand these, these girls that don't. So these are all glosses and stuff. So I'm gonna go through these really quick and there's a whole hodgepodge of these. Let's see what we got. We've got a glossed from Sleek Makeup. Let's take a look. I hate that brush and the color is okay. I'm gonna go ahead and pass that along. This one is Buxom and this one is, I can't even find the name on these. So this color is like purple, purple. Yeah, I don't think I'll wear that. So I'm gonna pass that along. Oh, I found a Ciate Liquid Velvet and this one is in pinup. Looks like this. Really pretty color. It's kind of dark, but I like that. So I'm gonna put it in with the other little guys. And I like to put these in my everyday makeup drawer too, so I know to use them. Um, this is a Buxom in Julie, and this is a, and I love their brush applicator. They're so good. Oh, and I like that color. So I'm gonna use that. It's going in with the minis. This one is in Jennifer, and it's a little bit more purple. Again, it's a gloss from Buxom right here. Love it. Yeah keeping that. So this is Neutrogena Hydro Boost Hydrating Lip Shine Radiant Rose and it's a little guy. I like that color. Oh big ass applicator. Yeah I like that. I'm gonna keep that. That applicator is Jesus ridiculous. I think that it's a little unnecessary but you know. Um, okay this is e.l.f. gloss in Mary Cherry and I don't like this brush at all. This is kind of like the Kylie brushes. I'm gonna give that away because I don't like the brush. I'll never use it if I don't like the actual applicator. I'm very picky like that. So I'm gonna give away these ones from e.l.f. the gloss as well in Muted Mauve and Funky Fuchsia. Looks like this. Again, I'll probably never wear them anyway, so I'm gonna give those away. And then I know I'm gonna keep these. This is Tanya, Kelly, and Katie, and they're all buxom. I love that these all have girls' names too. I think that's pretty awesome. So all the little guys are gonna go in this one in my everyday makeup drawer. So I think actually I'm gonna put in this gloss as well from Wet n Wild because it is smaller and it kind of fits in that little thing too. Okay, this is the Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick from Stila in Benzo. I do have two others from Stila. So these are all uh, full-size Stila matte liquid lipsticks. And then this one is a travel size. I'm putting this in with the glosses and the other little little guys over here, just so that they're all together. What is this? This is a Clarins, oh, it's like a lip oil. Yeah, it's a lip oil. I'm gonna go ahead and keep that. Okay, these are NYX Soft Matte Lip Creams. I never wear these. I've had them forever and I never, ever, ever wear them. Fortunately, they all have to go cutthroat today. This is a Wet n Wild color icon lipstick. What color is this in? This is Bare Your Soul. I'm going to go ahead and keep that color. It's really pretty. And I'm going to put it back in this little drawer. And these are Melt lipsticks. And this one is 666, which is terrible. I'm going to go. I like the color. I just mean 666 isn't good. This is Sext. I'm gonna go ahead and give that color away because there's no way in hell I'd ever wear that. And then this one is Dork, Dark Room, Dark Room. And again, that's something I'll never wear. So I'm gonna go ahead and give that one away. And I'm gonna keep the rest of my bullet lipsticks in here for the time being until I can kind of play around and figure out what I wanna do organization wise. Oh, good Lord, yeah. Oh. What in the, okay, yeah, this hasn't even been open. I'm never gonna wear this color, it's gotta go. This is my newest edition. This is a Flower Beauty Miracle Matte lipstick, liquid lipstick in Rosewood. It's so freaking stunning. This is definitely staying. This is a metallic lip cream. Okay, all the metallic lip creams have to go. Oh, here's another Milani gloss and this one's in Champagne. Okay, so the metallics gotta go because honestly, I'll never wear them. And some of them aren't even opened, so they have to go. If I haven't used them by now, they gotta go. This Melt guy from Too Faced gotta go. 
Um, this Flower Beauty one, this one is in dark and smoky and it's not anything I'm gonna wear. So I'm gonna go ahead and give him away. A Mori Metallic. Let's see here. This is an ultra glossy lip from Karochi and I'm never gonna wear that color. This is a lip gloss from Milani. Oh, here's two of them. Okay, so this one is champagne and the other one, it's natural luster. I'm keeping both of these. I love these glosses. They're freaking beautiful. Ultra matte lip, nope. ColourPop's ultra matte lips. I don't like this formula at all. This is a Milani metallic lips. And then what is this? A ultra satin lip. Okay, what is, what color is this? little dishes but look at it separating look how disgusting that is it's got to go in the garbage okay kylie more kylie is going um ultra satin lip ultra matte ultra matte ultra matte ultra matte okay all these ColourPop ultra mattes are leaving yeah those all gotta go these ones what are these these are urban decay i don't even think they make these anymore urban decay high color glosses and I'm never gonna wear that. So that's gotta go. And this one is in Quiver. That's a gloss. I mean, it's super opaque. Um, I'm gonna keep that guy. Let's see here. I've got more Bite lipsticks. I'm gonna see about, let's see here. Bite or Melt, I'm sorry, not Bite. Melt lipsticks. This one is Shady Lady. Yeah, never gonna wear that. I'm gonna go ahead and give it away. This one is Catsuit. Again, it's like super brown. I'm not gonna wear it. Probably why it hasn't been touched. Laced, super duper nude, never gonna wear it. Gotta go. Okay, I've got these guys from Makeup Revolution and I actually just got this, got these. This is Stiletto. I love this color, definitely keeping. This one is Fudge and Syrup. These ones are so stinking pretty. So we're keeping those because they're brand spanking new. And I like the packaging, it reminds me of MAC. So I'm gonna put those with the MAC lipsticks because they are exactly the same size. Okay, we've got another Wet n Wild one and this one is in No More Drama. I'm sorry, it's way too bright for me. So I don't think I'm gonna keep that. Um, let's see here. This is a matte ultra matte. It's got to go. Okay, I have YSL here. And let's check these colors. Oh my. Okay, so this is a YSL Rouge Shine and number... Shit, what is this? Number eight? Ooh, that's freaking beautiful. I'm keeping that one. And then this one is in 47 and this is a Rouge Shine as well. Lipstick. And that really doesn't have much color. Hmm. I like it though. I like the color of it. It just doesn't have a lo whole lot of color. Keeping that. Alrighty. Ultra matte. Gotta go. This is Lip Sense, I think. Grande Lips Hydrating Lip Plumper. And this is a plumping lipstick. I got this as a pair from my Makeup by Mario bag. I've never tried it. Hasn't even been opened. And the color is right there. So... Honestly, I'll never use it. I'm just gonna pass it along because it's brand new. Okay, this is a NYX High Voltage Lipstick. And what color is this? This is HVLS, orange, never gonna wear it. Passing that along. Gotta be cutthroat, y'all. I've got a NYX lipstick here, and this one is in 504. Yeah, this one's gotta go. It's crazy pink. So that one's gotta go. This is a Tarte. An angelic nude, this is Amazonian butter lipstick. I love this color and it's not rotting away to nothing. So I'm keeping that. I don't, they don't make these anymore, but oh my God, look at that color. It's freaking perfect. Yeah, keeping that. We've got like four or five that we've kept so far. Apparently I really like liquid lipsticks and glosses and MAC lipsticks and crayons, but not so much regular bullet lipsticks. So these are again little travel guys. So we're gonna go ahead and take a look at these. This is from Bite. This is the only thing I own from Bite and this is in Flush. 
Oh, he's pretty and he's real nice and light. I'm gonna keep him. Let's see here, Marc Jacobs. This is the only thing from Marc Jacobs I think I own. And this is Kiss Kiss Bang Bang. I like that. I think I'm gonna keep that, especially for summertime. It's kind of like a creamy pink. I like it. Okay, this one is Rouge from Makeup Forever. Nice and glossy. I like that. Keeping that. And then this is a studded lipstick from Kat Von D in Magic. I like that color. I'm gonna keep that. That one's pretty. Alrighty, so let's take a look at these guys. What are these? These are true color lipsticks from Sleek. And they're in little containers as well. Go ahead and, ooh. Um, nope, that's gotta go. Never gonna wear it. Didn't even know I had it. And this one is in Peaches and Cream. And that one's gotta go too. Nope. Let's go ahead and take a look at these guys and this butter one from NYX. This one is in BLS16. That is what the name is. That one's gorgeous and it's really sheen, so I'm gonna keep that. This one is from NYC and it is mahogany. It is dark AF. Oh, 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 yep, he's gotta go. Garbage. This one is from e.l.f. This one is blushing brown. Not even gonna swatch it, never touched it. Yep, he can go to somebody else. This one is Phone Call, and this is an Urban Decay. Again, never touched it. He's gotta go. Yep, bye. This is Elf in Runway Pink. I think I like this one. Oh yeah. That one's stunning, keeping that. Okay, let's see, CoverGirl. This one is Tempting Toffee. It's kind of a sheen, love that, keeping it. This one is from Julep, I love their packaging. And this one is Chit Chat. Yeah, never gonna wear that color. It's a little too mauve for me, gotta go. This one is, <laughs> it's a clear exfoliator and never been touched. Gonna go ahead and give that away. I don't like their lip exfoliators. And all of these Almay ones, I never touch. Not that they're not a good product, I just never touch them. I have other stuff that I like more. They all gotta go. So I've got, what are these? Touch of Spice. This was a recommendation from Jaclyn Hill. It actually looks pretty good. Yeah, that one looks good. I remember liking this color, but I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it anyway. Yeah, that's a pretty, pretty color. I'm gonna keep that. Touch of Spice, good. Siren in Scarlet, gotta go. These are Elf Beautifully Bare Satin Lipsticks. Okay, so these are satin and they look like this. I'm gonna go through and see if there's any that are decent that we might wanna keep. Let's find out. This one is Touch of Nude. I'm sure I'll probably love this. And they're very sheer, which I appreciate. Touch of pink. That's really pretty. Okay. Perfect pink. It looks like this. It's like super crazy, like nude. Okay, so let's see here. Oh, that's gorgeous. That's really pretty on. Wow. Okay. Didn't think I was gonna like that at all. This one is Touch of Berry. I don't think I'll like this one. Actually, that's not so bad. Damn. I'm trying to get rid of these, but I love them. I didn't know I loved them until today. Oh my God, Touch of Blush. All right, that's the one I don't like too much. I'd rather it be a little bit more sheer. I mean, it has a little bit of, it is pretty opaque, but I like the other one better. So, so that one's gotta go. Cover Girl, Cover Girl. Do we have any more? More Elf, Elf, Lip Land. Elf, Elf, Jesus Christ with the Elf. All right, um, okay, so I've got two CoverGirl here 
I've got one in sneaker and a demi mat. I think I just got this one. Yeah, this is the one I just got. Keeping that. Very pretty. And I like the top because you can actually see what color it is. I wish Mac would do that. <laughs> this is a croquette orchid and what's the finish on here? Never gonna wear that color. It's like metallic. So that one's gotta go. This one is from Maybelline On Fire Red. Looks like that. Again, never gonna wear it. This one is very cherry and it looks so similar to the other one. Yeah, that one's gotta go. Okay, Lip Land, what is this? I love that it doesn't have a name. Like, what the hell? Oh well, looks like this. That color is beautiful. Keeping that. And Lip Exfoliator from e.l.f., getting rid of that. All these e.l.f. ones. What is this? This is uh, Remmel. Remmel, okay, what number is this? 32. Eh, never gonna wear that color. It's pretty. It's really pretty, but I just, I have so many other things. Gotta go. This is e.l.f. Beautifully Bold. Let's see here. We've got Beautifully Bold, Flirty Flamingo, Ruby Red, and Fuchsia Fantasy. These all gotta go. Yeah, they're all done. This is Think Pink. It's gross from Wet n Wild. That one's gotta go in the garbage. This is, you know what? All of these are super freaking old from Wet n Wild. Yeah, all of these are really, really old. These ones from NYX are disgusting and old and so are the Wet n Wild ones. So I'm just gonna toss them all. They've been in here forever and they really shouldn't be passed along to somebody because I don't want them to get sick from something like that. It's just gross. I will repurchase Bear It All though from Wet n Wild. Let me go ahead and see if I have, yeah, I do have it right here, it's Bear It All. Okay, so this one is Bear It All from Wet n Wild. And this is probably one of the only ones I would ever repurchase because the color is freaking stunning. So I just wanted you to see that. I will definitely be repurchasing that one because those guys are disgusting and old and nobody, nobody should be putting that on their lips. That's another wet and wild one. All right, let's, another wet and wild color, disgusting, gotta go. These are Revlon. Let's take a look at Revlon. You know, these NYX ones gotta go too. Okay. This Coco one was from these guys. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, these guys are from Beauty Brands. I've had them forever. I'm gonna to toss those guys too because they're disgusting and old and you can't get them anymore. So, okay, so Revlon, let's see here. We have Sassy Mauve and this one is a cream formula. Seems to be okay. And it's not a bad color. It's pretty, I'm gonna keep that. We've got Berry Hout, Berry Hout, Berry Hout. And this one is a cream formula as well. I don't like that one as much. I'm gonna go ahead and pass that along. This is Blushing Mauve. Oh, I like that color from Revlon. And this is the classic packaging, by the way. It looks like that. And then this one is Wink for Pink. And this is a cream formula as well. That one's gorgeous, so I'm gonna go ahead and keep that. Um, okay, Bobbi Brown, another Julep one. Let's see here. Yeah, I'm not gonna keep this one. Yeah, that one's gotta go. This is Bobbi Brown, Uber Beige. That one's really pretty though. I'm gonna keep that. Think it forever. What color is this? This is in N4. Yeah, we're keeping that guy. All right, let's look at these studded ones and then the Gerard, Kim, Milani, and all this. Okay. So this one is Kat Von D. Oh, this one's really pretty. What is this? Lovecraft? Okay. I don't know if I kept the liquid lipstick in Lovecraft, but I really like the lipstick. The plain lipstick in Lovecraft. That one I'm keeping. Archangel, and I've never touched this one. Let's take a look here. It's nice and red. Hmm. 
yeah, I'm gonna keep that guy, I like it. This one is Hellbent, and this one's a bright red too. I might actually only keep one of these. Oh yeah, I'm keeping Hellbent. This is way more blue. And then I'm gonna get rid of Archangel. So Gerard Cosmetics, I don't purchase from them any longer because of the fact that they just have a horrible reputation. And this is Kimchi Doll, and what else? Which one is this, Buttercup? Jacqueline Hill made Buttercup with them, and these two gotta go. I'm never gonna wear them. They're never gonna be featured on my channel. They both have to go. Okay, Milani. Let's see here. We've got Bear Teddy, Matte Beauty, and Matte Darling. This is Matte Darling. It's pinky. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna wear that. Okay, Matte Beauty. That one's more my speed. I'll keep that guy. And then these two, there's Cabernet Blend and Black Cherry. Black Cherry is really pretty. And then it looks like that. And this one is Cabernet Blend. But again, I don't think I'll wear either of those. Yeah, I probably won't wear those. So I'm gonna go ahead and give them away. And then let's go ahead and go over these guys. This one is Matte Bear right here. I'm gonna keep that guy. This one is matte blush right on top here. I'm gonna go ahead and keep him. This one is matte adorable. Eh, pass that along. This one is matte it girl. Mm, never gonna wear it. This one is matte tease. I think I'm gonna like this one. Yeah, that one's good. And this is the last one. This is matte pretty. Okay, we're keeping that. Okay, y'all. So I'm gonna show you what I got rid of, like my roommate and I were just talking about. This is what I'm keeping. I pared down so much and organized and they look so good. Yeah, so I'm gonna reorganize a bunch of this and take these out and put them in um, either these kind of containers or put it in this drawer with these guys. Most likely that's probably what I'll do. What we got rid of, and Ray is holding guard. <laughs> he is holding guard of all the lipsticks we got rid of. Like this whole thing is lipsticks. Is that not insane? I have no idea how many are in here, unfortunately, but yeah. So that is all going to friends and family. They can pick what they want, take what they want. I am so done. <laughs> so foundations will be next whenever I get around to filming again, probably in the next few days, I'll do foundations. They are all up there. So I don't know if you can...